Hey everybody, my name is Xing Shadow, welcome back to another unboxing. In the last one you watched, uh, it should have been by actual time frames. Not sure how I'm doing the whole unboxings. I'm doing a lot of them releasing at the same time, I know that. So, uh, the last one should have been Enslaved Odyssey to the West, but hey, whatever. So anyways, uh, this one is from uh, Joshua, sorry, Joshua, uh, from Pan Panorama City. California. Uh, if you didn't know, I actually uh, grew, uh, grew up. I actually was born in California. Uh, I believe I was born in Los Angeles, California, actually. If not, Rose Park, California. Not really that familiar with Rose Park, if there even it really is a Rose Park, but whatever. Los Angeles, California. So anyways, uh, anyways Pan Panorama City, California. So yeah, and uh, as you can tell, it's a case game. Now, I'm expecting two games after Enslaved Odyssey to the West, and I don't know which one of this is the one I got. So, I can't remember from where I bought it from, or who the seller was, but uh, this is, well, it. So, I'm not going to show the other side, because of course I have my address and his address too. How do you say his last name? I don't want to say his last name, but let me just spell it out to myself. Hmm. I don't know why, when I say his last name, it kind of makes me think of Dracula. But it's not even with a D, it starts with an A, and then it ends with a Illa at the end. <laughs> so, yay. Alright, so I should have realistically have gotten, well, maybe I could still do it. Uh, a, dang, alright, a uh, knife, like I usually have. If I could use the force from over there to grab the knife. Which I can actually see from here, but maybe I don't need to. I don't know. All right, that's taken off. Took that off. All right, and uh, come on. Of course, you already know from the title and thumbnail what it is, but I don't. Ah. All right. Dang, how taped up was this? And it just came off with some of its. Good, fine names. Okay, how about we leave that part on? Because I might remember to say thank you at the end of the video. Okay. Uh, so, am I good enough to take it out? Maybe not. Okay. Okay, this is going to be a little while without a freaking knife. Uh, to let you guys know, it is for sure a PS3 game. That's what I do know. Okay. Alright, <sighs> trying to not fucking, I really want to get that stupid knife now, okay, come on, alright, by the way, the last time you saw Enslaved Odyssey to the West unboxing, I was sick, um, still I am sick, but not as bad as I was when I unboxed that video, so, I still sound a little bit, if I don't, then that's cool, but I am still sick, come on, alright, Alright, there we ah, 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 that's what I got. Okay, I know the game now. So, realistically, this actually is the second game I bought on a partner company, so that's good. Okay, come on. So, the last game I should be getting is the last thing I actually bought, so that's actually good for me. Alright, everybody, uh, we got... Huh, <laughs> Spider-Man Shattered Dimensions. Now, if you don't already know, I'm a big Spider-Man fan. Uh, I probably don't know the history of everything about Spider-Man. I don't. But I'm really big and engaged into the video game franchise of Spider-Man. Like, a lot. Uh, now, what I've known in is uh, there's four Spider-Mans to play as. There's uh, Spider-Man 2099, Ultimate, Amazing, and Noir. So, uh... 99 is explore a futuristic New York City. Ultimate, unleash the power of the black suit. Amazing, battle with innovative web combat and noir experience stealth-based gameplay. So, uh, I'm actually really excited to try this game out. i actually been wanting to get this game for the longest time. Uh, ever since it launched back in, uh, what was 2010? 2010, was it? Uh, yes, 2010. 2010. 2010. So, 
uh, finally glad I finally got it. Uh, so, yeah, I, uh, if you don't know which, which no is what, sorry, if you don't know which one is what, uh, 2099, uh, amazing, Spider-Man, Noir, and Ultimate. Now, the one I'm more familiar with, of course, is 2099, Amazing, and Ultimate. Not too aware of Noir, but now I will try that out when I uh, play the game. Uh, I've beaten ba uh, Batman. <laughs> I'm a big Batman fan, too. In a video game-based uh, ways, too. I'm a big... Uh, I'm a big... I've beaten Spider-Man Web of Shadows. I've beaten Spider-Man Edge of Time. Uh, I... Beat in the first and second movie. Never tried the third one. I never have, uh, other than a demo or something. And uh, I played friend or foe. And I feel like there's something else I'm missing, but if not, then those are all the ones I played in this current generation of Spider-Man. Now I have played Spider-Man for the Genesis. It just sucked. I played Spider-Man for the Nintendo 64 slash PlayStation. Better, better. But, uh, yeah, uh, the more common, you know, newer Spider Man games are, you know, the way to play. And of course, I played Spider Man a lot in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Not really one, but three. I uh, still tried playing them, but I didn't really play them as much. So, uh, I, want to, I want to say again to thank you to, so I like to keep this. <laughs> Uh, Joshua from Panorama City, California. Uh, I, I can't really even express it how I feel about it because, like I said, I've been wanting this game for a long time. Now, the thing is, the thing is, every time I saw this game, it was only for the Xbox 360. Now, there was times I was going to buy it, but of course, there's other things that probably was like, oh, this game is cheaper, this game is something I want more, blah, blah, blah. When I finally got to the point of getting Spider-Man Shadow Dimensions, I was already on the conversion of a lot of my 360 games to the PS3. If I got this on a 360, it would have been converting to itself to the PS3. So now when I got it, I can now uh, try it out and have fun with it. So I've all I need to do now is convert my Spider-Man Over Shadows game to the PS3, and I should be good. Which I'm actually currently let's playing at this moment, so it'll be a while for me to not let's play that version of the game. So. Uh, yeah, but anyways, uh, if anything, I'll finish the hero good side of the uh, Spider-Man web, web, web of Shadows, and then I'll continue off Spider-Man uh, Web of Shadows' uh, bad slash evil uh, uh, storyline on the PS3. So, the PS3 version of Web of Shadows is not that hard to find, it's like super easy for me to find. Anyways, already. Anyways, everybody, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys all for the next one, alright? Deuces!